kind of how would you describe how the run game was today? I thought we had a pretty solid day when it comes to the run game. Um, we did that one back to a good week of preparation. Um, thought we had a good run scheme, and everybody kind of locked in on the whole line and focused on it. And I think it showed in the results in the run game. Obviously, not the one we wanted, but. That, that fourth and one point to start the fourth quarter, he, Free said that you know, he called it a handoff and obviously went a different direction. Was there kind of some confusion up front on, on what to run there? Like there was a little bit of miscommunication. Okay. Um, I'll take responsibility for that as the center. We just got to be better next time. Different little bit of a different look, but we communicated on the sideline what we would do to that front. Just a little bit of miscommunication. Right. You guys have some success and, and some burst running the ball, especially there on the big end of the third. What was, what was working for you guys in certain parts of the game, you know, running the ball, especially getting out on the perimeter? Like I said, I think it just came down to executing our assignment that we practiced all week. Um, had a good scheme coming in. And, you know, it comes down to tight ends, receivers, the rest of the line, and I think we all just executed on those plays and it worked out. How much do you think this? Is the all fly coming up is going to benefit you guys being halfway point in the year and, and needing to kind of get healthy and refocus? Yeah, it's going to be huge. I know for me and a lot of the guys banged up in the locker room kind of gives us a, a chance to um, get our legs back underneath us and, in a sense, get a fresh start. Free City feels like the coaching staff needs to coach harder and just generally the team needs to come together a little more. I guess, you know, obviously two and four isn't what you guys expected or wanted at the beginning of the year, but kind of just what's your assessment of, of where this team is at right now? I agree. I think the way I look at it is it's just there's more opportunities ahead and there's no reason or um, there's no benefit in getting down or getting into a spiral. And, um, you know, there's more opportunities ahead and we just got to keep working. Thanks, Connor.